Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of my channel. My name is Karate Mayo and we are currently over here in my, well, well, in this world um, where I'm going to show you some, some building tricks and tips. Um, this is going to be a series that I'm going to start doing. Um, you may have noticed that last week I uploaded a video, um, a building tutorial about the gaming PC setup. Um, so make sure you go over and check that out. I'll put a link to it right up in that corner there. Um, but yes, today we are doing an episode on some tips for building a marketplace. So here we have our marketplace. We have all the three different stalls. Um, so much I know. Um, but here we have our wheat stall, and the thing that I've Use for all of these is the the little what's it called the, the thing that goes over the top um, I use the same colors as the item that they're selling um, which I thought is just a uh, it's a good little idea but this is a very simple little stall you have the fence gates coming in either side so you can go in and out um, villagers can't open fence gates so it's a great way of doing that and over here we also have a little cart which is wheeling over some goods. We have inside here the hay bales, um, which of course, you know, they will be useful. Um, but also, it's good. We have this nice little track that it's been leaving as it's been pushed along. Um, and also we have these rails on top, which obviously. Um, it represents the little, you know, the bits of wire holding it down or whatever. Um, so yeah, that's the little wagon there, you can take a an idea from that. Um, I also tilted one of the hay bales sideways just to give it a little bit more of a, um, not, not a very, what's the word, um, intentional, that's the word, make it look more natural than like it's been built. Um, we also have this melon stall, it's the same idea with the colours here, the villager. I put these melons around it, but also in here we have the little crates with melons inside it. This is supposed to be like a crate with melons inside it, but obviously I've just made an armour stand underneath it and put a creeper head um, on the armour stand which just looks really good. And on all of these also I have a, I, um, an item frame with the item that they're selling inside. Obviously um, you could do some fancy command block stuff to set the villager trade so that they just give you the right stuff. But I couldn't be bothered to do that. Um, and finally over here we have the, the bookshop. Um, and here we've used these bookshelves. Um, now, that was a very quick episode, um, this is just, you know, three four minute long videos and um, this little series, just some tips to use um, for your builds. So yeah, thank you everybody very much for watching this short video, um, I hope you can take a few ideas from it if you're building a market store in Minecraft, um, but yes, until the next video. Bye! Um, but yeah, thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. I messed up my words a bit there. Yeah, I, I, I guess I'll do that.